We have a lot of people to be grateful in this church. There are so many people that do so many good things. Carolyn is one. We thank her for this big effort that she does every year. <laughs> And today we have another big thank you. This is just an amazing story. We, we have amazing stories here. Jack Henninger is somebody who's done a lot for this place. He set up our endowment fund. And he decided that he wanted to have another legacy beyond the endowment fund even, something for this church. And so he decided he had an IRA that needed something to happen to it. And he said, you know, I think that we should have a solar system here in this church. And that solar system will pay the electric bills, will, will eliminate the electric bills for years and years and years and years. So Jack had us investigate. It turned out it was going to cost roughly $60,000 when you figure buying the system and doing some of the roof repair that would need to go on to make the roof ready for the system. Well, Jack put us well over halfway on the way there with his donation, but he didn't stop there. He got on the phone and he called up his good friend, Bill Wilson, and, you know, enthusiasm is contagious, right? He said, Bill, this is what, you know, I'm having fun doing, and Bill said, you know, I have an IRA too, and, and uh, it, some of it needs to go somewhere. And so before we talked to anybody, we were a long way towards getting there, and then Jack plays bridge, <laughs> and he told the bridge group, you know what, we're doing this great thing, it's going to be really amazing, and pretty soon we had phone calls coming in from the bridge group saying, I want to be part of that. So I'm here to tell you, we are going to have a solar system put on this church, yeah. <laughs> We don't want to leave any of you out of the fun. We're like three or four thousand dollars short. Maybe we, we want to pay for that roof part of it too. But we, we have enough. We know we can do it. So uh, if any of you don't want to be left out, just write a check and put solar system on the bottom. You know, I want to say something about that because it feels like we've been talking about money quite a bit in here. We, we got the organ. We've done the Imagine No Malaria. I want you to know that nobody ever needs to feel obligated to jump into these things. But one of the things I think is very special about this church is how many people are willing to say, I have an idea. And we run it up the flagpole, and when it's a good idea, a bunch of other people say, I want to be a part of that. And that's what happened with the organ, it's what happened with Imagine No Malaria, it's happening now with the solar system. So again, I don't want anybody to feel like they're always asking for money there. I'd like you to think of it as we're always inviting you into opportunities that somebody has thought up that are good for our ministry. So I'm, I'm so pleased that this one is happening. Speaking of opportunity for ministries, 